Hello everyone. Hope you are all doing well. Today, we will learn about the disease pest management of button mushroom. Button mushrooms are the immature form of the edible fungus Agaricus bisporus, which also includes Cremini mushrooms and Portobello mushrooms. In fact, all of these mushrooms are the same mushroom at different stages of maturity. Button mushrooms are the least mature, have a pale white color, and measure 1 to 3 inches across. The next phase of development brings us cremini mushrooms, which are the in-between stage, small and slightly brown in color. Then, finally portobello mushrooms, which are the largest, darkest brown, and most mature stage of the species. Mushroom, being an indoor crop, does not require arable land, except for some non-agricultural land to build the infrastructure for preparation of substrate, rising of crop, preparation of spawn, and post-harvest handling. White button mushrooms is grown seasonally and in environment controlled cropping houses in India, and both require building of basic infrastructure. Seasonal growing is done for five to six months when outside temperatures are favorable for the crop that is during winter months in northwestern plains and from September to April in the hills. Button mushroom farming is very profitable mushroom business. So, before start farming, you should know about the diseases and pests infestation in button mushroom for smooth and reliable farming. As because, once your farm become infected, then your whole hard work, as well as time, will ruin and you will make loss-making farm. If you are really interested in mushroom farming or cultivation and their management, then subscribe our channel for more interesting mushroom videos. You can join our free upcoming webinar about mushroom. Now, disease of button mushroom. Dry bubble, green mold, false truffle, wet bubble, bacterial blotch, and mummy disease are commonly seen in button mushroom farm. Number 1. Dry Bubble Verticillium fungicola cause this disease, which is also known as brown spot, fungus spot, or dry bubble. Dry bubble is most common and serious fungal disease of mushroom crop. If it is left uncontrolled, disease can destroy the crop into 2-3 weeks. Symptoms Muddy brown Often sunken spots develop on the cap of the mushrooms and grayish, white moldy growth seen on cap if infection takes place in an early stage, typical onion-shaped mushrooms are produced and remain small. Later stage, mushroom becomes dry. Management It can be controlled by Zineb on a large scale. Bursima Zineb 80 at 0.1 to 1.2% 2 is effective to control the disease when used before and between the flushes. It can be controlled by three sprays with diethyl Z78 at 0.25 or 0.5% or hexathane at 0.3% given at the time of casing, at pinhead formation, and after flushes of crop. Number 2. Green Mold One of the most common and destructive disease in mushroom cultivation is the green mold, which induce significant quantitative and qualitative losses. Symptoms Pure white, growth of mycelium, appear on casing surface or in compost, which resembles to mushroom mycelium. Later, mycelial mat turns to green color because of heavy sporulation of causal agent, which is a characteristic symptom of the disease. Management Maintain very good hygiene condition. Proper pasteurization and conditioning of compost. Sterilizing the supplements before use and mixing them thoroughly, preferably after spawning. Using the correct concentration of formalin, which is 2%. Weekly sprays of mancozeb at the rate 0.2% or bavistin 0.1%, TBZ 0.2%. Treatment with Zineb dust or calcium hypochlorite have given effective control of the disease. 
Number 3. False Truffle Symptoms Initially, the color of the mycelium is white, gradually the mycelial growth become thicker and develops into whitish, solid, wrinkled, rounded to irregular, fungal masses resembling like small brains. At maturity, they become pink, dry, and reddish. Finally, disintegrating into a powdery mass emitting chlorine-like odor. Management Initial infection can be checked by treating the affected patches with formaldehyde at 2% solution. Number 4. Wet Bubble Symptoms Fungus covers the mushroom with white mat of mycelium which look like cauliflower and it becomes creamy brown after few days. Small umber, yellowish brown to dark brown drop of liquid develops on the surface of the undifferentiated tissue in very high humid conditions. At this stage, an unpleasant odor comes out from the infected beds. Management For wet bubble management, keep sanitation in growth house, clean environment, around cultivation area. Incorporating benzimidazole, 150 mg per liter, in the casing soil. Binormal, at the rate of 0.95 gram per square meter, carbendazim, and thiabendazole, at the rate of 0.62 gram per square meter, also be applied to control the disease. Number 5. Bacterial Blotch Symptoms Brown spots or blotches on the cap in case of severe infection on the stipes. Circular or irregular yellowish spots develop on or near the margins of the cap which enlarges rapidly under favorable conditions and coalesce to form rich chocolate brown blotches. Management For bacterial disease management, keep sanitation, lowering humidity, watering with 150 ppm chlorine solution. Number 6. Mummy Disease Symptoms Fruit bodies have tilted caps and curved stalk. Base of the stem, enlarged, and tissue of the mushroom becomes spongy, giving mummified appearance. Management To prevent the occurrence of the disease, rules of sanitation and hygiene must be followed. Pest of button mushroom For its fly These cause much damage to the mycelium and sometimes make tunnels. Their front end is tapered. Their larvae cause more damage than adult. Mites In addition to insect pests, two mites very severely feed on the mushroom spawn as well as on mushroom buttons. Button and other cultivated mushrooms are infested by several groups of mites. Symptoms The initial infestation of mites in mushroom houses comes through raw material used for the preparation of mushroom beds. Occasionally, forehead flies also transport mushroom mites. Their presence generally indicates poor compost. These mites are also known to cause allergic reactions to humans. Nematodes Nematode infestation is more severe in button mushrooms. Symptoms The compost surface sinks. Mycelium grows sparsely in patches and turns stingy. The white mycelium starts disappearing from the infected mushroom compost, leaving only coarse strands showing black compost mass. The pinheads turn brown, watery, and remain stunted. The fruit bodies appear in patches in the beds. Integrated Pest Management Bed moisture content should be around 60 to 65 percent. Fix insect proof nets in the windows. In button mushroom, the newspaper should be treated with 0.1 percent formalin. Fix white insect traps to attract the flies. Spray malathion at the rate 1 milliliter per liter or dichlorovose at 0.5 milliliters per liter in the floor and sides to kill the flies and beetles. Never spray on the mushroom beds and buttons. Mix diazinin with compost at the rate 
200 grams per ton at the time of spawning. It is suggested that always apply neem oil at the rate 5% to avoid disease pest infestation in the farm. Because prevention is better than cure. Neem oil is organic and not harmful for human.